Okay, so here we got the drive leg out again, and we're cleaning it. And I've already gone through and cleaned it, so I'm going to spare you the gory details. But I want to show you what it looks like when the drive leg is uh, properly cleaned and works uh, correctly, and show you a couple little uh, uh, points. So this is how easily it should steer um, once the pin is all cleaned up and, and everything. And then here on the drive leg latch pin, I'm just going to show you, this just slides right out nice and easy. Take that out, and then we should be able to just pull the um, the other pin right out the end, and the yoke will come off, and so will the washers all fall down. But one problem that can happen is you can get dirt right in this here hole, and it'll build up from the bottom of the hole, um, build up from the bottom of the hole, and what happens is is this pin right here won't seat properly. This pin will actually be more this direction. And what happens when this pin is up is you've got this uh, pin for the latch running through it right here and that pin um, will put pressure on this washer. So you got a washer here and inside the the, uh, the yoke this pin is running through and it lifts this uh, yoke up tight against this part of the drive leg and that puts pressure on it and then when you go to turn the drive leg it, it binds and it's binding on this washer right here on the top and that's all caused by dirt down in there so when you clean the drive leg and you get everything all ready to grease or put tough gel or teflon or oil or whatever you want to use um, just make sure that down in there you get all the crap out and you really need to get in there with a screwdriver or some something and kinda scrape down in the bottom and, and just get the crap out of there because uh, salt water will splash it'll get past the grease somehow and it'll dry down in there you'll end up with this uh, with this uh, binding problem on steering so there you have it one drive out drive uh, steering mechanism